welcome back in today's video i am going to show you a employee attendance web application this web application is designed using the google app script the google sheet as a database and the google drive to save the employee selfies on the real time so without wasting your time i am going to show you how it will work let's see the demo first so you can see here this is our google sheet which we use as a database and in the employees sheet a column we have the user name section the user name column we can add here unlimited user so user 1 user 2 user 3 user 4 user 5 okay that's fine for you i just copy this particular user from here and uh, just commit here and paste it here the username or employee id what you can easily say you can uh, pronounce them and click on this login so when you click on this login as of now you can able to see here you are going to be logged in here successfully okay now you are successfully logged in here this is a so too much simple uh, employee attendance web application so anyone can able to use them okay so you can see here sometimes your worker go to an other core space and an other working space and other working area so they can easily enter their name for example i am uh, enter my name and the city for example i am city in the uh, hyderabad what you want to pronounce you can add so this is a camera actually working you can see here i have uh, hide with some material uh, due to some security okay so you just simply click on this login so when you click on this login so that particular employee which is the clock in their selfie is automatically captured and save it here okay so this will ensures that your employees will be uh, mark their attendance real time not any other employee mark their attendance so this is a security feature we have utilized here okay so in the main section you can also able to see here the profile image here the profile picture of the user you can easily see here this is the profile picture you can see uh, via the link as well so this is the clock out so no matter uh, when how much user time will be able to hear and how much he will going to hear uh, whenever he want to log out he want to clock out he simply click he simply enter their employee id or username they can uh, easily able to say you can see here the clock out button is appeared not the clock in why because the clock in is already exist in the database so you can see here the clock in is exist in uh, in the database on this particular time okay easily now you need to enter the your name and your log out clock out city okay now for example i am going to add here the law okay and click on this clock out so when i click on this clock out as of now you can able to see here it will be the clocking out and you can also see here the clocking out successfully done here okay now you can able to see here the total time in minutes it will spend 1.36 mean 1 minute and 36 seconds he will be there for the work okay so also this is for educational purposes or and it's a beneficial thing for, for the educational institutes or for the companies or for the small uh, organizations okay so this is completely making using in the google infrastructure how to set up this uh, when you uh, get the code when you get the copy uh, you will see this kind of interference in front of you okay so when you see this kind of uh, interference in front of you don't hesitate you simply click on this make a copy so when you click on this uh, make a copy so a copy of that particular google sheet will be successfully added in your google drive now what you need to do you simply need to go to the extensions uh, click on this app script so when you click on this app script you will redirect it to the app script editor so the code is already there and if you want to change the time zone you can easily change your time zone from here right now i am using the indian asia kolkata so you can also use an other time zone of your according to your country okay that's fine now what you need to do you don't need to do anything you can simply click on this deploy and click on this new deployment so when you click on this new deployment sometimes it will show like that so don't hesitate in this condition you can simply click on this setting icon click on this web app and select anyone from here and if you want to use only for yourself you can select only myself 
and if you want anyone can able to use with google account access you can simply with anyone with google and if you want that anyone can easily be used that you can simply select the anyone okay you can also give him a name like version one and click on this deploy so when you click on this deploy it will updating the deployment and it will ask you for granting the permission so when you grant the permissions it will give you a web app link so i will just uh, select here and uh, select my um, uh, you can select your email and click on this advanced and uh, click on this go to attendance system and click on this allow and uh, when you click on this allow as of now you can able to see here it will updating the deployment and it will give you a web app url you can simply copy this url and open this url from here directly so your web app is successfully being executed and note this web app is work all the app on all the devices but not work in your mobile device because your google account is logged on that particular account for example this is a google account uh, for example user one uh, account is logged on your android devices and this web application is executed on the same uh, google account so you first need to log out that account from your device then it will work on your mobile devices this issue is faced by a lot of many people in our recent uh, experience so i think um, i will explain you this how uh, why you solve this you simply just log out your google account or you can simply go to your incognito mode and you can easily use out this web application so hope so you like this video you like this concept and the next video we will be upgrading uh, some more applications and you can give us the idea to make our channel better make our contact better content better and you can uh, my comment box is always open for you all and uh, you can press the like subscribe and press the bell icon so any new video we can post i can post you will be notified first of all so we thank you very much take care we will meet you in our next video with something great